Well, welcome. This is an exciting day uh, for FC Cincinnati. Uh, we appreciate you coming. Um, I can't be more excited about the progress that FC Cincinnati is, is making on all fronts uh, right now. Um, and we're ready for, uh, you know, the opening of an exciting season. Uh, I want to recognize and thank Mike Bone, the athletic director at University of Cincinnati, for being here today. We appreciate uh, your and UC support and, uh, and our partnership. So, with that. Thank you. Thank you, Carl, and uh, thank you all for coming. Uh, today is another exciting day as we build our franchise uh, with our uh, second big player announcement uh, and welcoming our players here to Cincinnati. Uh, I want to recognize our head coach, John Harks, and assistant coach, Ryan Martin, who have done an outstanding job in building this roster. You know, we started this in August. Um, uh, with, with an idea in mind, and obviously you have to build and make it a reality. And, and I, I know we always had great confidence in John and Ryan that we were going to have a great roster, but seeing this actually come to, uh, come to be has been a, a very fun and exciting thing. And uh, we're very thrilled to start the preseason next week and really get underway in preparing for the season. Uh, we're excited to head down to IMG in Florida. Uh, in mid-February for a few weeks uh, and really get some good competition down there. Uh, and then, of course, with the schedule now out, we're excited to have our inaugural game, home game, uh, on uh, April the 9th. And uh, we want to encourage fans to go to fccincinnati.com and, and check out our schedule uh, and hopefully buy some tickets. We have a beautiful facility on UC's campus, the new Nippert Stadium, and we think we're going to have a great environment, and our players are going to provide a, a very great, exciting soccer for fans to come and support. And so thank you. And with that, let me turn it over to our head coach, John Harks, to introduce our players. Thank you, Jeff. Thank you, Carl. Uh, thank you, everybody, for being here today. Um, just to echo a little bit of what Carl and Jeff had said, that we knew <clears throat> from the beginning that it was going to be a process uh, in terms of the building uh, of a club from uh, brick and mortar from the ground up. And uh, we feel really confident uh, that we have a talented group, and not only uh, guys that we and, and really emphasize throughout the whole club uh, in terms of the ownership group to general manager Jeff Birding and, and all the way through, that we have guys that are winners on field and off the field, uh, great characters. And th this is, you know, from our perspective, we want to make sure that we take pride in, in the guys that we're putting out in the field. And when they put the jersey on, that it's for their heart and they understand the community and the connection to what FC Cincinnati is all about. Uh, and that's the reason why we're all here. So just to be clear on that, we're very excited about what we've been able to do. Obviously, it comes down to a commitment from the players to actually be part of this uh, through the process as well. Uh, so I want to thank them for you know, making sure that they come out here and, and be part of this. And they, you know, the second group is a quality group. Uh, we have a very talented uh, group of guys with good personalities as well. Um, and the main thing uh, through the interview process and talking with the players is that they all want to be here. Uh, so from our perspective, that, that means that they're fully invested. And so without further ado, I'd like to, uh, if you guys don't mind, you know, just kind of introduce the players and uh, we'll have you guys come up for a handshake, do your favorite dance, and then we'll go from there. Uh, the first one is going to be uh, Harrison Delbridge, who's 23 years old of S uh, Sydney, Australia. He's a defender who played at Appalachian State. He was named NSCAA Scholar All-American, All-Southern Conference, and a Southern Conference All-Tournament selection in 2011. Uh, he first signed his professional contract in March of 2014 with Sacramento Republic of the USL and signed in February 2015 with the Portland Timbers II, also of the USL. We're very happy to have him on board. Congratulations, Mark. Thank you so much for being here. You want to say a few words? I'm good. You, got, you sure? Yeah, you covered it all, I think. Okay. All right. Get a few pictures here. Yeah. Let me get, come in the middle, please. Next year. Excellent. Thank you, Harrison. Thank you, Jason. All right. Uh, next player, uh, Antoine Hopinot, 25, a forward from Paris, France. Hobano played soccer at Princeton University, where he was first time All-Ivy in 2009 through 2011. Ivy League Player of the Year in 2010. 
NSCAA, second team All-American 2010. Philadelphia Union had selected uh, Hopano in the third round of 2012 MLS Supplemental Draft. Spent the last two years playing in Major League Soccer with the Philadelphia Union and also some time with Harrison, uh, Harrisburg City Islanders, reaching the USL Finals in 2014. We're happy to have Antoine here today. Congratulations. You want to say a few words? You sure? Nobody wants to speak today. All right. I think Omar said he'd speak. <laughs> Uh, Omar Muhammad, 19 years old, a uh, young player, Columbus, Ohio, played at Jackson College in 2015. His first professional contract is with FC Cincinnati, become the youngest player on our roster. We welcome him here today. Thank you. Omar was spot spotted playing with the U, uh, uh, U23s up in Columbus Crew uh, with Ryan Martin uh, this summer. So we were able to convince him to come down here, which is very, very good. Uh, next player, Andrew Wiedemann, uh, 26 years old, forward from San Ramon, California. Was drafted in 2010 by FC Dallas in the second round. He also played, uh, had his playing experience with Toronto FC and Ottawa Fury last year reaching the final in the NASL uh, final uh, championship game against the Cosmos. Wiedemann played his... Uh, university ball at California Berkeley from 2007 to 9, earning first team all Pac-10 honors in 2008, 2009. Thank you, Andrew. Great to have you here, buddy. Thank you. Quiet, please, on the set. Everybody quiet. <laughs> You want to say a few words, real quick? No, I'll keep it consistent with the other guys. And Are you sure? Yeah, no. You don't want to sing a song? Maybe later. Okay. <laughs> All right. Wow. This is when they're quiet, huh? This is great. Uh, next player, guys, we're very excited about 33 year old player, uh, Forward, who has both MLS and international experience. Former Cincinnati State, University of Cincinnati star. Omar Cummings was drafted by the Colorado Rapids back in 2007 MLS Super Draft. During his MLS career, Cummings had a career-high 12 assists in 2009, scored a career-high 14 goals in 2010, and was named to the first MLS All-Star team in 2011. He also represented Jamaica in international competition, was a member of the 2010 Jamaican national team that won the Digicel Caribbean Cup. Yeah, I'm just making sure I say that right. Uh, we're really happy, guys, to bring back home uh, Omar Cummings, and we welcome him here today. So thank you. A uh, couple of things, guys. Guys will be, uh, individual players will be available uh, for the media. Um, I'm going to hand the microphone back over to our general manager, Jeff Birding. And I know also it's a pretty special day, guys, because whenever you see uh, an old player come back that you helped groom uh, through the system at the University of Cincinnati, we have the head coach of the men's team as well. I'd just like to come up, say a few words, if you don't mind. Uh, Mr. Hayes, please. <laughs> Thank you. It's a real honor and pleasure uh, for me to be here today. Certainly want to thank Mr. Linder, Jeff, and uh, John for really making this an opportunity to have professional soccer here at, uh, in the city of Cincinnati. Um, you know, Omar is a special person and a special player. He's uh, not only the, the, the best player to, to ever put on a University of Cincinnati men's soccer uniform, but he's a much better person. And it's a pleasure for me on behalf of the University of Cincinnati to welcome Omar back home to Cincinnati. Welcome, O. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you so much. Are there any, uh, any questions that um, any of the three of us can answer before we turn it over to uh, allow you to get with the players? Okay. There is one thing I just want to add as well, uh, real quick, and Jeff, if you want to. Uh, players that were not uh, available to be here today, uh, Jimmy McLaughlin, 22-year-old uh, midfielder from Melvin, Pennsylvania, played at Colgate University, uh, was a Patriot League Rookie of the Year, signed with the Philadelphia Union in 2011, made his debut in the U.S. Open Cup in 2012, 
uh, made his first appearance on October 24th in 2012. He was loaned to Harrisburg City Islanders for the 2014 season. Jimmy will be arriving uh, this uh, Monday, I believe. Um, Cody, is that correct? So he'll be available. Um, the other one is an international player from Madrid uh, on our scouting trip that we had this summer in Spain. Uh, Ryan Martin and I were overseas. We saw Alvaro Anton Ripoll, 21-year-old player from Madrid, Spain. Uh, played domestically for Osasuna Junior A in Division Honor. Uh, he will be coming here next week as well. I think he arrives on Tuesday. Sunday? There you go. Cody, you're fired. He'll be arriving here on Sunday, and we'll have Alvaro uh, available for the media moving forward with that. Okay? Thank you, guys. Uh, Jeff, I just wanted to ask a question. Any update on the season ticket sales at this point? Sure. Uh, we are continuing to do well. There's obviously been a, a lot of activity the past uh, two weeks with the schedule coming out, player signings and the like. So uh, Jeff Smith uh, and all of our guys have been working very hard answering the phones. Uh, and, um, you know, we're not at 4,000 yet, but uh, our last announcement was over 3,000, and we just continue to sell and continue to climb. I, I do want to add, just because uh, we had a great combine this past week, uh, four days, Monday to uh, Thursday at wall to wall, uh, John and uh, Ryan and, and Jamie Starr, our goalkeeper coach, with the help of our whole uh, operations staff, did a great job running a very professional combine. And uh, we are in the process of signing a number of players from the combine. Uh, once the players uh, sign the contracts, we turn it into the league, to the federation, and they get the contracts get approved. We'll have some additional player announcements next week, probably on the eve of when we uh, start the preseason next Wednesday. So uh, we, we had a great combine, and and you know John spoke about just the high talent level. Uh, it was uh, uh, very inspiring to see all of these guys out pursuing their dreams to be a professional player. We look forward to making those announcements next week. So any other questions? Otherwise, we have the guys here. You want to get just a, a quick photo? You guys want to come in? Yeah. Come on up. We'll go to the end. Some come here, some go there. Thank you. Another hand for the guy.